Uh, hey guys, it's Woody the Unexceptional Gamer. Welcome to Wife Wednesday. Woohoo! Right? Nice. Well done. Thank well you. Done. Yeah. So, um, topics for this week. Packages. Oh, right. We we're going to talk about Pac-Man. So, a package just showed up at the door. And, like, so I have Black Ops 2 coming to me in the mail. Yes, you do. And you have... A ring coming in the mail. She has a ring coming for her in the mail. And we're all, like, every day when, like, a UPS or a FedEx truck comes by... We're, it's like an ice cream truck. Uh, I start, run out there. I'm salivating like Pavlog's dog. Like Pavlog's dog. Is that dog. my package? Is that my package? Yeah, oh my god, is that it? Is it it? I'm like, like a door running to the window, scratching at the wind. No. Dog. I'm like a dog running at the door, <laughs> scratching at the windows. That's, that's what I'm going for. And it's like, is this it? Is this it? My package was mailed this morning from England. It's not for me. It's not for you. No, yeah. it's not. It can't be. Like it, it, it's you know, it's coming Friday. It's supposed to come Friday. Okay, so my package has been like we don't Who know knows? when it's coming. Yeah, like we have no delivery day. So, uh, for those that don't know, this is like my first like this is the <laughs> what? Why are you so sweaty? I have a hard time with this hard, purchase. You do. <laughs> I. It, I'm a really good woman. You are a good woman. Oh, uh, gamer tags. Let me know if I did this right. Here's the deal. Her ring was battered and worn right did you lose the diamond in your engagement ring i didn't lose ring? the diamond but it fell out and my ring instead of it being a circle it's now like this odd little square rectangle thing yeah so her, it doesn't actually go on your finger her wedding and engagement ring is just wrecked yes uh, we, we've been married for 16 years i guess and the thing was cheap like i was broke when we bought it yes and you know we, we didn't we weren't really wealthy or anything when we got married and we had mentioned something about this on the cruise video because right, I got right. hit on by a few guys. Yeah. Because <laughs> they don't know I'm married. Because <laughs> she looks downright single with her, like, that doesn't seem like an engagement wedding ring combo And you're to like me. MIA while I'm sitting at poolside. I'm a little bit seasick. You are we're very seasick. <laughs> but anyway, back to the topic. You're having a lot of problems with your purchase. Yeah, it's just... It's, uh, he, doesn't, he thinks jewelry is stupid. Jewelry is stupid. Back me up, guys. Um, but it makes me happy, so you... That means you're stupid. That means I'm stupid. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I aim to play. I'm such a, a smooth talker. You are. Yeah. I love you more every single day. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, so I I bought Jackie a, like, replacement engagement slash wedding ring. And she is totally psyched for it to arrive. I can't wait for it to arrive. And, like, I, you know... Whatever, I don't really care. <laughs> you don't care, but you want me to be happy and get it. I do, you I do. do. So, you're so not now all every time any of these delivery co- trucks come, Jackie and I are both like scratching at the door, waiting for our big pushing Jack back because he, you know, yeah, attacks the front door. The dog sees food in the form of like mailman delivery person, and, and you and I at the door, <laughs> and you and I see awesome presents and prizes. Yes, but it was not your game, and it was not my ring. It was Colin's replacement for toy story 3 because the other one got all scratched up so he's yeah. very excited he's I, happy colin's happy the man he's tired but he's happy he he's, just had fencing so he's really tired he's laying but. right behind me on my floor he had fencing yes he did how is he getting more competitive yet it depends on who he fences if he fences somebody younger than him he's not really sure what to do like am i supposed to kill them or what if he fences someone older then he feels free to just slash and whack and poke and i mean colin's really nice like he's really timid when it comes to like the younger kids he's like am i supposed what am but I supposed like to do? he's uh, so uh, colin's homeschooled and sometimes i wonder how the whole homeschool thing impacts him socially because that's like the big thing on homeschool kids right yes. that that's uh, sometimes socially they're not the same as the other kids and um but you he's know a sweetheart I sit there and wonder like well what impact has colin being homeschooled had on him and uh, she's looking at me because we didn't like plan this or anything. Yeah. But uh, <laughs> I'm listening to you, because I, I can't stop listening to you. <laughs> so I like when I you know put on my like cruel outsider's hat and think you know well what's Colin like? How's Colin doing? I think you know well one impact that he's had I think by spending so much time with you is he's just become really really nice. Like oh, it, so is that my compliment? I don't, I mean, <laughs> I'm not even like positive it. it's a compliment. Like, <laughs> it, it sounds like a great thing, right? But I wonder if, like, that lack of... Killer like, instinct? Killer instinct, capability of coarseness. I killed a mouse last week. 
<laughs> you are you are darn near the Terminator. I am. <laughs> yeah. I had to throw it out. Yes, you did. And it was yucky. I know. I That's used to broom in it. a dustpan, but yeah, then uh, like <laughs> something about dead mice. I'm getting off on the column thing. I getting off on the column thing, pedo. But the um Oh, back on the column. I just want to wrap up that topic. The impact that I think him not being around, like, you know, the middle school or elementary school environment has had is that he's just, like, really, really sweet, nice guy. And I hope that always works for him and not against him. I think it will. But, yeah. you know, it, when he's with someone who, I guess, is he considers his equal or, or older, he's, you know, aggressive and, you know, goofing around and stuff like that. So he had okay. a good time. But okay. with the younger kid, it was, I don't know, not so good. <laughs> all right. All right. The other, on, on the mouse thing, God, like, something about dead mice. Like, it, it, I don't know if you guys listening have ever, like, caught a mouse in a mat, mouse trap. They're tremendously effective. You put peanut butter on the mouse trap, the little bar comes swinging around, and it crushes its skull, and sometimes brain leaks out. Was there brain this time? There's no brain this There wasn't time. any brain this time. It was all contained in his, like, little fleshy head. and But his eyes are still there, and his, like, little facey smile thing oh, yeah. I mean, he's is they're unimpacted. Cute, but they're, they they're, poop all over the place, and they're dirty. and They're, like, formerly cute. Like, you look at this mouse, yeah. and you think, wow, this was once probably a timid little animal that would just love to crawl up to you and sniff your fingers and eat cheese so what's the rule in our house though uh, if it invades your space it's dead exactly <laughs> i have a much easier time enforcing that rule against humans than like mice and insects no and because what happens pests. if i take that mouse i put it outside it's going to come back in it knows how to get back in it knows where the food source is so it has to die you saw the secrets of our life and now you must die <laughs> <laughs> you're ruthless i am ruthless yeah. and then i make you dispose of the body <laughs> i yeah which is which is exactly what happens it is exactly what happens and let's not forget i got a great i got my first fan letter oh yeah that fan letter was awesome i want to say his name was peter murphy murray murphy no. I don't, don't don't give out last I'm names. Sorry. But he was so cool. He, he complimented you on like your Colin's improvement in speech and how wonderful you were. And he's like, I don't know what I you're know, doing, it but it's worth. It was my first worth. one. It was a great one. It so was very it was for me. one of the best fan mails. I'm gonna like, put collect. it in a frame and hang it on the wall. Let's and then do any that. Time someone comes over and gives me a hard time about homeschooling, I'm like, look at my letter. <laughs> Let's. I totally think we should frame it. We can. Yeah, for real. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed Wife Wednesday. Bye. If you like the video, click on like. Um, if you want, subscribe in the right-hand corner in two videos you might have missed. Puerto Rico will be our 51st state, maybe. <laughs> and Black Ops 2, score, streak, and recoil thoughts. Oh, my God, that's amazing. You know, you're getting better at this. It's not I as am. easy to laugh at you. It isn't. I like it when you stumble around and you're like... I'm like a uh, pro. <sighs> Almost. Sort of. Kind of. Uh -huh. So which of these two videos do you recommend, like... I recommend the Black Ops 2 score streak and recoil thoughts because I love hearing all your thoughts. On video games. On video games. <laughs> Especially on this video game because someone asked me what this video game was and I was like, oh, modern black. Uh, I should know this. <laughs> you should. <laughs> but whatever. It's Toy Story 3. Enjoy. Bye. Bye.